Hey, what's up, everyone? Uh, my name is Reza Sharifi. I am pursuing my uh, master's degree in computer science at the University of Mysore, India. Uh, when I was in my bachelor's degree, I found my uh, favorite programming language, Python. Since then, I have been working on various projects. I've been developing a different kind of project using Python. So I've found it fascinating since day one. So here I am offering web development with Python. Recently, I started an online course uh, teaching students web development with Python. So the reasons that I uh, started working with Python, I'm gonna tell them later. So, but here I am. Let me give you a brief introduction about the course. So it is web development with Python course and uh, I'm sure you know everybody is familiar with these concepts front end back in the database for the front end well, I'm gonna use HTML CSS bootstrap and JavaScript for back end I'm gonna use Python Flask framework and uh, for the database I'm gonna use MySQL database so the software that you need for uh, for this course would be Python 3. You can use any versions of Python. I mean uh, Python 3, of course. You know because uh, the latest version of Python 3 is Python 3.8 or 9. I'm not sure about it, but so you can use any versions. It should be Python 3, so it's better because the codes that we are writing are all in Python 3. And uh, you may use a text editor I would recommend you to use Sublime as long as I'm using Sublime 2 so uh, let's get it started with the course uh, first let me uh, tell you how to um, install the the softwares so for installing Python 3 you may go to the website and uh, you can check about the websites uh, to actually download this Python 3. You can simply write here Python 3 uh, download it will give you the very first uh, you know python.org so it's it's always I, I would always recommend you to go here and to download the software the software from here it's because this is the um, the official uh, website for for uh, Python so you go to downloads and you can you can uh, download 3.8 this is the latest version but I recommend you to use Python 3.3.6 it's because uh, you may use uh, as long as we're doing very basic projects so you may use any versions it doesn't matter but when you're uh, when you're working with machine learning deep learning or natural language processing if you're doing projects with these you know, with the, if you're dealing with TensorFlow and Keras, so I would always recommend you to go with the Python 3.6. It's because, you know, in the latest versions, some of the packages are not uh, defined, so you may face some errors. So you can find here 3.6. You can just download it. Once you download it, you will get the... Uh, you'll get the, uh, the software. So I have already... Uh, got the software here if I want to try to um, install it so I will install it install it so but here I won't be able to install it because I already have it so if you face any error just please contact me or you can search videos online on how to configure you know Python on your uh, system and the next uh, the next one would be sublime text editor so you may check here for sublime text editor uh, here, here here it is and then you can download it download for windows if you're on windows if you're on mac anywhere you are just please you know you, you could download it no, not a problem so to make sure whether python is installed on your machine please open cmd and type python if you if you don't get an error that means python is installed on your machine if it is not install you're gonna get an error so python 3.8 3.7 i'm not sure why it is 3.7 hey that's all right no problem 